Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve the auto IT error, line zero, error opening the file. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we are going to start off by opening up a web browser of your choice. doesn't matter which one. I'm going to open up Microsoft Edge. And then I'm going to have a link in the description of the video here, guys, to a Microsoft web page here. Again, this should be learn.microsoft.com. And it should be an auto run utility. Go ahead and just select that to download the file. And once it's on downloading, it should be in a compressed file format. Go ahead and open it up. And then you want to go ahead and select the auto runs application. And then we're going to go ahead and run it. And you can close out of the web browser at this time. We're going to agree to the license terms. And now that the auto runs has been launched, just wait until everything has been filled in. So there should be a field that says everything. If you select the everything tab, which should be the default landing page here, you would locate the auto run entry from this list. Again, you would follow the file path and you'd right click on it and you would select delete. Again, you would do that for whatever process or item was specifically causing the issue here for this pop-up. So pretty straightforward process on that, guys, on how to remove that. And if for some reason there's some residual virus, perhaps you might want to do a virus scan. And you can also run a system file checker utility scan as well. So we're going to close out of here and open up the search menu. Type in CMD. Best results should come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right-click on that and select Run as Administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now into this command prompt window, type in SFC, and then a space, forward slash, scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Once that has concluded, go ahead and close out of here and then restart your computer. So there you go, guys. Pretty straightforward process. Do a positive to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.